Hello everybody, this is Money Mom. It's getting real here on the channel. It's Tuesday. I want to actually talk to you about an addiction that I have. This is not clickbait and actually this is a little bit embarrassing. You guys know that in March well, I said that we're going to be doing some health challenges and all of us are going to be doing things to make us healthier. Well, I want to tell you about an addiction that I actually have and it's something that I'm going to go gold turkey on and I'm giving up. Let me show you. I'm not kidding about this either. I actually have an addiction to non-dairy coffee creamer. And this, and I'm actually not teasing about this. I know people love their coffee and people can drink several cups a day. It's not the coffee. Let me just tell you this. My husband many times has said to me, Dawn, do you want some coffee with that creamer? First of all, I love the smell of it and I love the flavor of this. I could literally drink this coffee creamer without any coffee. That is, I know, scary to hear. If I read the ingredients off here, and first of all, I can't pronounce most of the ingredients. Uh, no, I, I, from my opinion, I should not be putting this in my body. This is not good for me, and it keeps me, I feel dehydrated, and it keeps me from drinking water. In March, in addition to exercising every day, I am going to be giving up coffee cold turkey. And some of you might say, well, Dawn, why don't you use half and half? Or, or why don't you just use a little bit of sweet and low? No, I'm going cold turkey for a couple reasons. Number one, drinking coffee keeps me from drinking water. And I really feel like I want to be drinking more water because I feel a lot better when I'm more hydrated. That's number one. Number two, I've got a lot of healthy herbal tea at my house. For example, some hibiscus tea. I don't know if I pronounced that correctly. And it'd be better for me to be drinking that rather than drinking coffee with this creamer. My husband and I go through one of these a week. He even said that sometimes we go through a little more than this. I think there's a lot more healthy things I can do for my body then drink this coffee with the creamer because I'm not kidding when I tell you drinking this and sitting at my desk working keeps me from drinking water. I'm just getting real with you guys and I look forward to drinking it and it'd be one thing if I had one cup of it and I measured out one tablespoon and I had one cup a day. That maybe wouldn't be so bad. I don't even know how many cups of coffee I have a day. I'm going to say probably four. And they're the large cups. They're not the little cups. I don't know how much of this I put in there. And I know that this is not good for my arteries and it's not good for me. I'm not telling anyone else not to use this. I'm saying for me, it is not a good choice. So for March, I, and I don't, you might say, what are you going to do about April, May, June? I'm not sure yet. But I really want my health back. And today I watched a video of a woman in her 70s who was doing CrossFit. I used to do Camp Gladiators, and at first I didn't do as well, but after a while I could do all these planks, mountain climbers, burpees, and I was doing really well. I remember somebody in the background, and I could hear them while I was doing all this workout, and you know, I was a bigger girl. I weighed in the 170s. I heard some young person say, wow, that bigger girl sure can move, and they were talking about me. Well, I want my health back, and I'm going to have to make some changes, so I'm willing to give this up. Are any of you willing to give up anything or add something for a healthier you? I wanted to get real with you guys about this and tell you this is not doing me any good at all. Now, I can still get it from my husband. He uses just a tiny bit in his coffee, but since I use too much of it and I depend on this instead of water, I'm saying goodbye to the coffee creamer. I just wanted to share this real video with you guys. This is Money Mom signing off, and as always, I love you.